Hello! Welcome to today's lesson on the solar system. We'll be exploring an exciting and fundamental aspect of space physics. Here's what we'll cover today. Firstly, we will understand what makes up the solar system and the concept of orbiting around the Sun. Next, we will understand how the Sun's gravitational pull holds the solar system together and keeps everything in motion. Finally, we will identify the various bodies within the solar system. So what is the solar system? The solar system is a vast ensemble of celestial bodies held together by the Sun's immense gravitational force. At the heart of our solar system is the Sun, a massive glowing ball of hot gases, primarily hydrogen and helium. Around the Sun orbit eight major planets, including our Earth, along with their moons, and numerous smaller objects such as asteroids, comets, and dwarf planets. What does it mean for planets and other objects to orbit the Sun? The term orbit refers to the path that these celestial bodies follow as they move around the Sun. The planets and other objects are constantly in motion, traveling in elliptical, oval-shaped paths due to the gravitational pull exerted by the Sun. Now let's look at the role of gravity. Gravity is the fundamental force that shapes the structure and dynamics of our solar system. The Sun, being the most massive object in the solar system, exerts a powerful gravitational force that keeps all the planets, moons, and other bodies in their orbits. To understand gravity, think of it as an invisible force that attracts objects towards each other. The greater the mass of an object, the stronger its gravitational pull. Because the Sun has about 99.86% of the mass in our solar system, its gravitational force dominates, keeping everything bound together. As planets orbit the Sun, moons orbit these planets. For instance, our moon orbits Earth because of the Earth's gravitational pull. This nested arrangement of orbits ensures stability and order within the solar system. Our solar system is made up of numerous components. Each of these celestial bodies plays a unique role and contributes to the overall dynamic of the solar system. The main component is planets. There are eight major planets in the solar system, Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. Alongside planets, there are also moons, asteroids, comets, dwarf planets, and meteoroids. In upcoming lessons, we will explore some of these components in greater detail. We will learn about their unique characteristics and their role within the solar system. This will give us a deeper understanding of how our solar system is structured and how it operates. In today's lesson, we delved into the solar system and its key components. We learned that the solar system consists of the Sun and everything that orbits it, held together by the Sun's gravitational force. This includes eight major planets, moons, asteroids, comets, dwarf planets, and meteoroids. We explored how gravity serves as the fundamental force maintaining the order and motion of these celestial bodies. Understanding these concepts lays the foundation for appreciating the vast, interconnected universe and the remarkable physics that govern it. Let's get ready to delve deeper into each celestial body and discover the intricate details that make our solar system so fascinating. Watch the rest of the GCSE physics course at Sophos Education.